friends welcome back to my channel my name is Blair so if you guys watched my last vlog I did mention that my husband was trying out at a new church in New Smyrna Beach so we went there over the weekend um I think it went really well we will not find out if he got the job though until maybe tonight but probably tomorrow so we're pretty anxious about it <laughs> I am trying not to be I'm trying to just be like just give it to God and try not to worry about it and it's okay everything's gonna be okay <laughs> I am trying not to like stress out or anything but um yeah so obviously we're moving um so we have a whole bunch of boxes I'm going to show you guys the whole situation in front of me um my mom was so sweet she ordered a whole bunch of boxes and tape and bubble wrap and wrapping paper all the things I love her I'm the best mom ever um so yeah she is coming this weekend to help us um start packing up like non-essential stuff but we're not really doing anything today so we figured that we would start um so I think I'm going to start packing up the homeschool room, especially all the books that we have. And then my mom was saying like books are heavy. And in the past I have um, packed a whole bunch of books in a box. It was so heavy and the bottom broke and it was a whole mess. <laughs> so we have a whole bunch of stuffed animals um, in the homeschool room and like the little hammock thing. So I'm thinking that we're gonna do books and stuffed animals because we don't really like we don't need those things right now and while we're packing I'm also like storing a whole bunch of donation stuff in our room so it's a whole mess so yeah but I think this is one room we're gonna um start packing up um I am leaving out like um school stuff that the kids are working on right now but um everything else we can start packing so I just figured I would vlog a little bit today and yeah, <laughs> I'll take you guys on our packing and moving journey. Okay, so it is a whole mess in here. We have boxes here, boxes here. My husband brought his computer over here. Um, yeah, it is like so messy in here. <laughs> the kids have toys all over the floor. Um... I think I'm just gonna go ahead and throw this calendar away. This is the last year we can use it. And um, yeah, I just don't want any of those pieces to get lost or anything. So again, like I said, while I'm packing, I'm gonna be throwing stuff away and donating stuff. I think that's one thing I'm getting rid of. Um, but yeah, there's like a whole bunch of stuff that I know we have to get rid of. We just have so much stuff, even though I feel like I'm constantly decluttering. Oh my goodness. Let me know if you guys feel the same. Huh. All right. So my husband is over in his office and he's packing up books. He has Lexi and Jeremiah. Avery is playing with Maverick and they're happy in the playroom. I'm going to try to pack up some stuff. All right, guys, so here we are packing the very first box. So excited. So I did put um, a lot of books on the bottom and then the very top, I put a lot of stuffed animals. So I totally filled the box, but the box is not like full of all heavy stuff, but it is still balanced. So that's what we did in the schoolroom. My girls do have a book that they're reading right now. So Lexi has a book, Avery has a book. So we don't need all of these books out right now. So that is why um, this is the first room that we packed. I also left out some school workbooks, but obviously they're not playing with these stuffed animals. So this was the first room I wanted to start with. I think it is the hardest room. We have so many books. We have all of the um, kids like activities and board games in here and everything for school so I wanted to get that done all right so the first box is done and it's still kind of heavy we did have someone give us a whole bunch of books but the girls did not seem interested in all of them so here I was just asking Avery what she wanted to keep and what she wanted me to donate 
I'm not going to keep a book if the girls are not going to read it. I just don't like holding on to things that are not going to get used. So that's what we were doing here. And then Mavi started to get kind of fussy, so he wanted me to pick him up. So I'm just giving him some love in here. A lot of this video is probably going to be a voiceover just because I have four kids so it's always loud and crazy here and so I am just trying to pack as much as I can in between being a mama, in between cooking, and all of that. So this vlog is a few days of packing so I'm also going to be showing you guys what I made for dinner and everything. So right after I did some packing in the schoolroom, we made breakfast for dinner. All right, we are making breakfast for dinner. So I just washed all of these eggs that were in the basket. We are also making some sausages and I have biscuits in the oven. We're going to be making some gravy. I'm also making some tater tots. All right, so Avery and I were in the middle of making dinner but we are pausing to come take care of the chickens. Hi, babies. Oh my goodness, we had some very hungry babies. They were trying to jump out at me. They were starving. Sweet babies. So we have five boxes packed and that is just from the homeschool room, but we have the bookshelves empty. So this is the second day of packing. I wanted to finish up the school room. So I am emptying the desk out. I want to empty the closet that's in here and the closet. That's where we keep all the board games and that's where they have like some rainy day activities, that's what I call them. Like if we can't play outside or something, they have some stuff in there that they can do. Um, there's also some drawing stuff in there, so I wanted to just pack all of that up because we are not using it right now. pretty much emptied the whole school room except for some toys um some stuff my daughter has to go through over there that is all trash these are like super old blocks i think they're going to need a new box soon <laughs> but yeah all these boxes just for one room i emptied this whole closet so goodbye I emptied the desk. This is just my husband's stuff. But yeah, yay, one room is done. And now it is time for me to make dinner. Since we are packing to move, I wanted some easy stuff for dinner and tacos always last a couple of nights. So I am making my salsa. So we have tomatoes and serrano peppers and an onion and cilantro and i just blend it all up and it is so yummy after i blend it all up i squeeze a whole lime into it and i add a little pinch of salt and it's so good and you get so much i think it's way cheaper than buying salsa from the store and it's so much better so the next morning my mom came over and she brought really yummy donuts before she got here i gathered up all of our decorations and laid them on the dining room table Obviously, you don't need decorations when you're packing, so that is a first good thing to pack. So, I laid them all out. For some reason, Maverick was super clingy that day, so she ended up packing this like all by herself, which I was so grateful for. I don't know why he was so clingy that day. So here I am watering all of my plants. Um, it was about time to water them. I water them every month and a half, two months, so now I don't have to worry about them until we move. 
Guys, look how big our tomato plant is. We've pretty much like neglected it and there's so many tomatoes in here. So I'm about to get them off of here. Look at all those tomatoes. The tomato plant that we neglect decides to grow tomatoes, but all my other ones, they die. All right, this is everything we got done on the third day of packing when my mom was here. Um, we even got the big TV down off the wall because we needed help doing that. And we brought the other TV out here for now because that's going to be easy to pack up. My mom is taking a dollhouse and those dollhouse toys, like the furniture and stuff, to her house. So they have it there. And then she brought lasagna over for dinner and some bread. It was so yummy. It was like half noodles and half zucchini. So that was really good. And then after dinner, I wanted to start packing a little bit in the playroom. So I started with the Barbie stuff. So one whole box is all Barbies. And every time Maverick saw my phone, he was coming over there trying to get it. He's such a little stinker, but he's so cute. <laughs> so that is what we got done that day. I just wanted to start a little bit in the playroom and then you'll see in my next packing vlog that I do more in the playroom, but I just was happy to start doing that. Okay, so three days of packing, well one whole day and then like the first two days was just kind of little half days just starting, but we got the schoolroom done, we got all the decorations packed, we got the big TV packed away, and we started on the playroom. So super happy we have boxes in the homeschool room, and then we have boxes all in our living room, but I'm happy that we are chipping away at it. I do have to get those baby dolls down in the playroom. I kind of forgot about those, but it's fine. I'm gonna just wrap those up and then pack Avery's baby dolls with them. And you'll see that in the next video, but I got the china cabinet all empty. So things are moving along. I hope I was able to give you guys some packing motivation. Thank you for being here and watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.